Last year, we released our How to Set Up a Digital Signage Advertising Network series, consisting of nine short three-minute videos. Next are all nine episodes back-to-back, -back, including some bonus material on how you can set up and make money with your very own digital signage advertising network. Now, be sure to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more strategies on how to make money in this niche industry. Call for a consultation or visit iMotionMedia.com. How to Set Up a Digital Signage Network by iMotionMedia.com Digital signage advertising networks are extremely profitable, if done correctly. The concept is to find high-traffic locations to install digital screens and sell ad spots to people who want to advertise in their area without spending an arm and a leg, yet still get the exposure they normally would advertising in traditional medias, such as a local newspaper or by delivering flyers. Let's use a 10-screen network as an example. First, you need to find 10 high-traffic locations where people dwell for a period of time, such as restaurants, coffee shops, hotel lobbies, gyms and spas, hospitals and clinics, shopping malls, supermarkets and convenience stores, and other such locations, all within a two-mile radius from one another. Proximity is important, as clients won't advertise in areas they don't serve. This means your entire network of 10 screens should be within a two to three mile radius. Exceptions apply depending on variables, such as if you're doing this in a large city or a small town, its size and area, as well as its population. The price you charge per ad spot also depends on these variables. You may also decide to charge advertisers per location at a lower price, or for all 10 screen locations in your network for a higher price. Here are the two different business models. Business Model 1 Let's say, for example, you charge $300 per year for one location, and you sell 50 ads per location. Your net income would be 50 ads times $300 per ad, equals $15,000 per screen location. Multiplied by 10 locations equals to $150,000 per year in revenue. Business Model 2 If you charge $2,500 for all 10 locations, then 50 ads multiplied by $2,500 per ad would also yield you $150,000 per year in revenue. Even if you only charge $1,500 per year for all 10 locations, multiplied by 50 ads would generate you a $75,000 yearly income. Not bad. The great thing about digital signage advertising is the renewals. Most of your clients will be renewing on a yearly basis, and that's called passive income. Sweet! Once you've secured your 10 host locations, install a TV with a media player in each location. Then advertise your pricing, available locations, and contact information within your own network, as well as adding a few advertisements on behalf of your host locations and their products. Remember, this is digital signage. You can also make money servicing fast food restaurants who understand the need to go digital by providing them with digital menu boards and monetizing on hardware, such as the TVs, brackets, mounts, and installation, as well as the back-end services, such as content management software, menu design, monthly maintenance fees, updates and consultations, averaging a few thousand dollars per job. Make sure you have a website advertising all your services as well as pricing, a PayPal account so you can accept payment, business cards, and all necessary marketing tools. Also, be sure to strategically calculate your loop time. In digital advertising, loop time is the length of time in which all your combined ads run from beginning to end. So if you are placing ads in a convenience store, note the average amount of time one spends in a convenience store is about 5 minutes. 5 minutes times 60 seconds per minute equals 300 seconds. Divide 300 seconds by 10 seconds per ad equals 30 ads. You can fit 30 ads in a convenience store. Whereas in a gym, the average person spends an average of 60 minutes. So 60 minutes per hour times 60 seconds per minute equals to 3,600 seconds to which you can fit 360 10 second ads in a gym if you play each ad once. As per in a restaurant, the average dwell time is 45 minutes. There are many different ways to set up an ad network, calculate ad spot prices, and approach local business owners so as to install an ad screen. Call us for a consultation on what your approach and business model should be. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more information, tips and tricks on how to make money with digital signage, which is fast becoming mainstream. Imagine owning a business where every other business is your potential customer in an industry with no limit on how much you can earn. Now you can with iMotionMedia.com. Get started and take advantage of our 10-screen network package. 
Here are some examples of how our clients are monetizing using our digital signage services. Sam lives in a big city. He installed flat screen monitors in 10 popular locations, three restaurants, two coffee shops, two hair salons, two convenience stores, and a supermarket. He only charges $500 a year per location, including the content design. He puts 20 ads per location, making $10,000 per screen in each location. Multiplied by 10 locations, Sam makes $100,000 per year income. Meg and Randy live in a small town and run a 30-screen network located in various mom-and-pop diners and shops. They charge $300 per location, $1,500 for 10 locations, and $2,500 for all 30 locations. They also provide digital menus to most of the locations where they sell advertising. Dennis sells digital menu boards to local fast food restaurants. He also upsells on the TV screens in their installation, as well as the media players running the screens, the menu design, content management software, and iCloud hosting. Before he got into this new business, he used to only install TVs for a living. Now, he went from $120 per job to $2,500 per job adding these extra services. How to Set Up a Digital Signage Network, Part 2, by iMotionMedia.com Once you've installed your TV and media players in all 10 of your host locations and added all the necessary advertising for you and your host, it is important to make sure you have a professional website, as you will be judged based on your online presence. If you don't already have a domain name or website dedicated to your digital signage business, you can get one at www.godomainexpress.com. Ask about GoDomainExpress.com's discounts on certain iMotion Media products. Also, have a tablet available that you can bring with you to potential clients, where you will run a demo of your portfolio to showcase what you offer. Don't worry, iMotionMedia.com will create one for you as part of our reseller program. Now armed with a professional website, business cards, flyers, demos, and all the necessary marketing tools, you are ready to take on clients and projects. We provide ongoing consultation along the way. Make sure that you have created contracts, liability clauses, and terms of service as well. These parts we cover within our consultation depending on your location and types of businesses you wish to approach. Always have a few extra media players on hand. You never know when a multiple screen digital menu board job will pop up. Lastly, read a little on digital signage advertising as an industry, just to understand the industry a bit better. It would cost about $1,000 per location for the hardware and software to start a 10 screen network and about $1,500 to set up a 10 touchscreen interactive kiosk network. If you charge $2,500 to advertise in all 10 locations, you would break even on your entire network with only four sales. Even at a more affordable $1,500 to advertise in your entire network, you will only need seven sales to break even. If you charge $300 per location, then you would break even after 34 sales. Also, bear in mind, the lower you charge, the quicker you sell. You can also offer both pricing options. Remember, all prices are not written in stone and vary greatly depending on your location's demography. Also, be sure to use the CPM rule for guidance. CPM stands for cost per thousand and helps calculate your advertising rates. We'll help you with that. You may also engage in interactive touchscreen kiosks as you place unlimited ads for even more revenue in a touchscreen kiosk as well as digital restaurant menus, but on tablets, as both are part of digital signage but interactive. We can also help you with that as we provide interactive digital signage as well. If you have the entrepreneur in you and can sell, there's no limit on how much you can earn in this niche industry. If you are not the salesman type and can't sell, it is advisable to find a partner who can. When starting up an ad network, there are four areas to think about. One. The back end, which is the designing and the software running the ads. Two, the front end, the sales of ad spots and dealing with clients. Three, the investment needed to purchase the hardware necessary for a network. Four, most importantly, your host locations, because without them, you can't set up a multiple screen network. To recap, make sure you have a professional online presence, a network of busy locations where you can place screens for digital advertising or interactive digital advertising, and the right business model based on your area. Don't forget to subscribe for more tips and tricks. Now that you have your host location set up and are selling ad spots, make sure you price your rates reasonably. You will be selling your ad spots steadily throughout the year, renewing many of your existing clients on a yearly fiscal basis and earning extra revenue on other digital services that you offer.
Remember, many digital signage advertising networks are run by media companies that also offer other types of digital and marketing services. These services can also be offered as an incentive to potential host locations. We'll provide you with these services. You can charge clients on a monthly or yearly basis per ad spot, as well as by offering packages for single or multiple locations. There are many different formats when designing your ad screens. We use the entire screen when creating our ads so people can focus on the entire message. Lastly, make sure you have strategically chosen your host locations. Remember the CPM, cost per thousand rule, which means make sure that each host location has at least a few thousand visitors monthly. You can also start your network through one or multiple investors who will invest in all the hardware, software, and content design, as well as your online presence with your website, marketing material, and business cards. There are a few approaches on how to get an ad screen into a location, such as 1. Pay rent to the host for placing a screen. 2. Offer a percentage of profits to the host. 3. Offer some free or discounted services for the host's business. You can use one or all three models mentioned, or any other partnership agreement that feels right. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tips and tricks on how to start and run a digital signage advertising network. The whole purpose of digital signage advertising is to make extremely high profit margins relative to your investment. When we say choose your location strategically, what better way than to target businesses with multiple locations, such as a franchise? Entering into a partnership or agreement with a franchise is my favorite way of acquiring multiple locations all at once. Let's focus on a gym or fitness center. Each gym within the franchise will dedicate a screen so you can place digital advertising. In exchange, you will offer a percentage of your net profits. You can get your foot in the door by also offering advertising for the gym within their locations, such as their rates, private classes, schedules, advertise their after-workout shake and protein bar, menu prices, gym store, events, or any other message they wish to send to all their members while working out. Their in-house sales will go up and we'll design all the ads included in our franchise package. How much you will charge advertisers to place an ad in each or all your locations will vary based on factors we covered in other parts of our videos. One of these factors is the number of locations the franchise has. Example, if a gym has 50 locations and you charge $2,500 per ad, this means the ad will be placed in all 50 locations where it will play each and every hour the gym is open. If you place 110 second ads, your loop time will be 17 minutes. This means your client's ad will play every 17 minutes, so a person who trains for about an hour will see each ad three times. That's a $250,000 yearly revenue, and for a percentage, a great incentive to why a gym will partner up with you. One of the more popular methods among our clients is the investment method. This is where they invest in their own network usually starting a first network with between 3 and 10 host locations. A host location is where a TV is installed, so as to charge for advertising. Patrick set up a 5-screen network at a beachfront touristic area. He installed 5 TV screens in 5 popular locations, 3 hotel lobbies and 2 popular convenience stores. He charges $750 to create an ad and place it in all 5 screen locations. In his first year, he collected 100 ads, making $75,000 per year in revenue. How he proceeded was by funding his own network. He spent $1,500 on five 40-inch TVs, $1,000 in TV installation fees, and $5,500 for 10 media players, 100 ad designs, including the content management software that runs the ads, and a professional website to advertise his packages and prices. Patrick earns extra revenue on renewals and ad updates growing steadily on a yearly basis. $75,000 in revenue minus $8,000 total cost leaves Patrick with $67,000 in net profit. iMotion Media is helping Patrick grow his network. He also offers whiteboard animation design services, averaging $500 a week in extra revenue. We handle all the back-end work for Patrick's white-labeled business, leaving him time to expand his network and sell more. It's simple. First visit GoDomainExpress.com Purchase your domain name with WordPress hosting and iMotion Media will assist you with the website. Feel free to use a website or a domain name you already have. If you're looking to start a digital signage advertising network, 
Let us take care of your content, software, backend, and marketing with our experience managing such networks for our clients. Digital menu packages are also available for restaurant franchises. Patrick used the 100 ad designs to create one ad for each of the 100 businesses he planned to approach and offered to sell an ad spot. All 100 businesses were located within a two-mile radius from the three hotels and two convenience stores where he had installed a TV screen and media player to advertise these 100 businesses. He then contacted all 100 businesses and offered to promote them in all five locations for $750 for the entire year. He did this until he got 100 businesses aboard, paying Patrick $750 to be displayed in all five locations. Now all of these businesses are getting seen by tourists that stay in these hotels and also shop at the convenience stores, in turn bringing more business to all of Patrick's advertisers. Don't forget to subscribe for more tips and tricks on how to run a successful digital signage advertising network. Become a digital signage reseller. The concept is simple. Find a location or locations where there is a high volume of foot traffic with a period of wait time such as restaurants, coffee shops, spas, gyms, grocery or convenience stores, and install a flat screen with internet connection. Then sell ad spots to businesses in the area who want to attract new local clients. Charge $250 or $500 or even more per year for each ad spot, depending on how popular your location is, which is still less than the average price you would pay for a small ad place on a local newspaper for just a weekend. Multiply the amount you charge by the number of ads you sell. You do the math on how much you can make. We supply you with everything from the software down to the actual content design. So all you do is concentrate on selling your ad spots. And the best part, you keep the revenue. It's your business. We also set you up with your own corporate brand and provide you with all the necessary marketing tools to get you started. Here's an example. Say you place a screen in a popular restaurant or gym where people spend at least an hour eating, training, or just simply waiting around. Would you pay, say, $300 so your ad can play multiple times per hour, every hour, all day long for an entire year? If the answer is yes, then so would many other business owners. With just 30 local ads multiplied by $300, you can earn $9,000. Now, multiply that by 10 locations, that's $90,000. What if you charge $500 instead of $300? The possibilities are endless on how much you can make in an industry that has no ceiling and hardly any overhead. Moreover, you are not limited to just advertising. You can even supply digital menu boards for fast food restaurants. Everyone is going digital. Put it this way, if you're a restaurant owner and still operate with analog billboard menus, it's just a matter of time before you will be seeking our services. We can help you set your ad prices depending on your location or situation, even if you own your own business and need to make extra revenue. Welcome to the digital world. Welcome to iMotion Media. Call us toll free at 1-866-777-8669 and take advantage of our free consultation or visit iMotionMedia.com for more information. There are many types of layouts when deploying a digital signage advertising screen. You have the traditional three-zone layout, where you have a ticker at the bottom, scrolling news updates, the weather report, either on the left or right of the screen with its own zone, and finally, the ad in the larger ad zone. There is also the split-screen layout, where you can divide the screen into two equal zones, rotating the host's products or services in one zone, and your advertiser's ad in the other zone. You can also utilize the entire screen and rotate the weather and news updates every couple of ads, as well as include the host's products and services within the loop. How many spots you assign is entirely up to you. Make sure your network is profitable and that you calculate the number of ad spots with regards to your loop time. Avoid clutter, as adding too many messages and images onto your screen simultaneously will prompt viewers to overlook or miss your advertiser's messages altogether. Here are a few tips for designing content. Make sure you keep your target audience's age into perspective. If you are advertising in a club, your advertising will be geared to younger people who frequent clubs. Whereas if your screens are located in a golf course in Boca Raton, your general audience will be older retired viewers, and as such, your content should be relevant to that demographic. Location, example, 
where you place your screen within an establishment is also key. Remember your designing principles, colors, and types of fonts used, as your goal is to make it easy for people to read. Always be mindful of spelling errors. Finally, understand the key elements and that your digital signage network will be as effective as your content. When choosing your host locations, be diverse by selecting different industries when creating your network. You can choose different industries such as spas and salons, hotels, convenience stores, gyms, coffee shops, clinics, restaurants, and other such high-traffic locations where people dwell. Or select more niche locations, for example, only hair salons, spas, and other such businesses in the beauty industry. Or you can select just hotels and motels, or a collection of convenience stores. This way, you can aim for a more targeted advertisers. You can also provide a call to action prompt as an intensive for upselling advertisers to spend more on their ad spot with you. Should finding multiple locations become difficult, you can start your network with only one location to utilize as a host. To do this, you must make sure your one location is a strategic one. For example, a university where you can find restaurants and coffee shops, bookstores, convenience stores, laundromats and other types of businesses that cater to students and charge them up to $1,500 per year for each ad spot. Getting just 20 advertisers will yield you a revenue of $30,000 per year. Not bad for a starter network. Other such one location hits are airports, clinics, malls and train stations. Franchises are also great as it allows you to pick up multiple locations while dealing with one person. Subway stations are just as profitable if you can secure all of them in a city by contacting whoever is responsible of making a decision. Digital signage advertising is quickly replacing static signs. Understanding the dynamics and how this industry works is key in your success, along with finding the right locations. Be sure to like our videos and don't forget to subscribe to learn more on how this industry works and monetize. When deploying digital signage advertising screens, make sure you use strategic incentives for your hosts wisely and effectively, like adding QR codes that redirect viewers to your host websites or provide more information about their products and services. These tools can also be used as an incentive for the advertisers so as to purchase ad spots from you. QR codes can also be used by advertisers to display digital coupons, specials, social media pages, or redirect to their websites. Other incentives are cross-advertising between host locations, digital services that you offer, such as video SEO and other such services that you can include at discounted rates. By keeping your advertisers happy, you can count on yearly renewals, which is a great source of recurring income requiring minimal work. Digital signage solutions have extremely high profit margins relative to its investment if done correctly. You can start an ad screen ready for advertising with a TV costing $300, a $100 media player including software, another $300 for a bracket and pay a TV installer, totaling $700. Let's say it even costs you $900 to deploy an ad screen and you decide to go cheap charging $300 yearly. Just three ads would give you your entire investment back. You can probably find three investors that have businesses and ask them to front you $300 each to start your first screen in exchange for an ad spot. If you have any questions or would like us to make a video on a specific inquiry you may have on digital signage advertising, interactive touchscreen kiosks, or digital menu boards, please email it to us at info at imotionmedia.com. You can also leave it in our video inquiry form located on our website at imotionmedia.com within the FAQ section. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Many entrepreneurs try to do everything on their own when attempting to deploy a digital signage advertising network. Some succeed, while others don't. That's why we recommend seeking out partners, investors, or both. In our past videos, we mentioned that if you are not good at selling, then it is advisable to find partners that can, while you concentrate on the initial host locations. In part 5 of this series, we showed you how one entrepreneur started a 5-screen network with $5,500 and generated $75,000. Even though compared to most startup businesses, $5,500 may not be much of an initial investment. It is still a substantial amount. 
Therefore, seeking out investors is an ideal way to fund your first network. You also need to deploy your network in a manner that will help you expand it later, efficiently. This is why partnering up with the right people is important. Digital signage advertising is the most efficient form of out-of-home advertising. It is projected that the digital signage industry will reach $17 billion by next year and $20.3 billion by the year after. It is easy to make money as a digital signage provider if you know what you're doing. If you are motivated, there is no limit on how much income you can make. Download the ebook How to Make Money with Digital Signage, Monetize, from Amazon for sales strategies and the necessary steps on how to get started in the digital signage industry. Click the link below. Digital signage advertising is a billion dollar industry, and there's no limit on how much you can make if you know what you're doing. Now, this ebook will show you how to get started. You can download it from Amazon Kindle at the link below.